In today's digital world, it's easier than ever to copy, paste, mashup, remix, download, and publish content. People's writing, artwork, videos, and images can be inspiring, but they're also easy to take without thinking twice. When people treat the internet like a free-for-all, legal and ethical situations can arise. That's why it's important to know about copyright and fair use. It will help you give and receive credit where credit is due. So what's a copyright? Copyright law protects your control over the creative work you make. It requires people to get your permission before they copy, rework, or share what you make. Most things that you find, download, and copy and paste from the internet are copyrighted. That doesn't mean that everything online is on lockdown and can't be used. It can, as long as you check who owns it, get permission to use it, give credit to the creator, buy it if necessary, and use it responsibly, then you're not stealing. Now, there are times when you can use a small part of someone else's copyrighted work without permission or paying a fee. This is called fair use. Fair use only applies when using content in certain instances. Schoolwork and education, news reporting, criticizing or commenting, and comedy or parody. Specific guidelines, what we call the four points of fair use, must also be followed. First, you can only use a small amount of the work. Second, you have to add new meaning to the work to make it original. Third, you need to rework it and use it in a totally different way. Finally, you have to use it for nonprofit purposes. In other words, you can't make money off of your new creation. No matter what, it's a good idea to give credit to the creator of the work you use. It's just a sign of respect. So what should you do if you find something online that you want to use? As a rule of thumb, check who owns it, get permission to use it, give credit to the creator, buy it if necessary, and use it responsibly, which means judging for fair use. You're a creator, innovator, and inspirer. Think twice about your rights and responsibilities in our online culture, and then pay it forward.